Hello and welcome back to Punk Cake. We're playing uh, Moon Pong. This is uh, just out as of like an hour ago. Let's see if uh, I can speedrun get this up to uh, on YouTube same day. That'd be kind of cool. Um, I've been really looking forward to this. I uh, I follow the uh, the Punk Cake dev on Twitter, and I've been seeing this from basically its conception to release. And every every time I saw a little animated GIF float by, I'm like, that looks like an absolute ball so we're gonna we're gonna play it we'll see uh we'll see how difficult it is punk cake games are pretty uh pretty difficult generally so we'll see this one's got some pretty nice accessibility i've turned the flashing down so i don't think i'll have to put a warning on this but all the same i will warn you that if you have uh, uh problems with flashing images or um, very animated backgrounds. You might not want to watch this one, but I have turned things down, so we'll see. The game as it was originally intended, fresh. So the moon has decided to leave Earth, and uh, because of <laughs> our, our lack of climate action, and we're sending out the moon paddle in order to bring it back. I see this may be your first time controlling the moon paddle. Would you like me to explain the controls for you? Um, sure. Can play with either the mouse or controller, but we recommend playing with a controller. Um, all right. Well, but will you recognize my PS4 controller? Uh, if your controller isn't automatically recognized by the game, go into the settings and make sure the right one is selected. Well, we'll see. I'm I'm connecting my PS4 controller. We'll see if it works. Oh my God! It does. With the mouse, place your cursor on the screen to orientate. Orient the ma moon paddle. With the controller, choose your favorite analog stick and use it to orient the moon paddle in the direction you're holding. It's recommended to hold the direction at all times, so try to keep a relaxed grip. With the mouse, you can uh, click or spacebar. On a controller, use any shoulder buttons or trigger to charge the moon paddle. This will stretch back the moon paddle. Stay at maximum radius for as long as you want and then release it to smash into the moon. It doesn't matter how close the moon is to the paddle when you release it, they just need to touch. Experiment with it. You can play this game one-handed and you may find it the more comfortable option. I recommend you try different configurations to see what you work. Gamepad controls may take a little getting used to, but once you're there, it's much more comfortable than on the mouse controls. Okay, I'll take your word for it. Amazing uh, that you, that this is not in Steam right now. Uh, Steam release is planned. Um, so the fact that there's PS4 controller support is really, really nice. I, I, huge props to the, to the dev. That's it. Good luck. All right. So we have a circular, um, moon-ish arena here, and I can hold the button down to smash the ball. And, uh, I'm basically constantly holding a direction in order to try and keep the ball from floating away. And this is just an incredible concept. I gotta say, um, Punk Cake, like, consistently and constantly knocking it out of the park or to the moon with these really, uh, <laughs> just, like, incredible concepts. And then, like, the execution on them is, like, seriously top-notch. I just, uh, like, I always love the look of the games. Like, the background alone is something I'd, I... You know, would not expect to see in a lot of games. Yo, is that is that the the crown of the pirate king I'm seeing there? No, it's not. There's no way. Whoa, that was a little spooky. I don't know what that is. I'm obviously I have control to like navigate thing the ball, but I'm trying to just like keep keep surviving. Oh, oh, the cloud does not like that. Oh God. Luckily, um, there's no penalty for getting hit by a projectile. The, the, the projectile's main threat is to create chaos with the, uh, the ball. Oh, God. No! Alright, well, we've lost, a we've lost a moon life. Everything is moon, of course. Ugh. You can like, oh, I, I, I didn't mean it. Oh, that was bad. So I'm, I'm already like, vastly out, out of control here. Oh. Oh. 
Okay, we've got a boss, and I died. That was our- Oh, that was not our last life. Incredible. Uh, oh my god. What? Shop. I really don't know how to, like, control the direction of the ball. Software update. Get an extra choice for the th free item at the end of each level. Yeah, good luck. That's if I can get to the end of the level. So how do I get my ball... I guess by moving it to the end edge of the paddle, you can kind of control it. I would have thought it would be the other way. Oh, that was our last life for sure. Shoot. I would have thought that it would be the other way around because of the angle of the paddle. But I guess this may, this is easier to kind of predict. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna try a little bit harder to guide the ball towards enemies this time. And keep on top of Ooh, what? What? Oh, we got a we got a weird power. It did some funny things to our ball. So you can kind of like charge your ball or your paddle. Ooh, damn, that was unfortunate. Between every shot, it's a little bit tricky though. The timing is is not quite there. I love the music in this game. Everything, honestly, is like top-notch right now. Okay. Oh. Don't- you don't want to hit that while it's spinning. Oh. Okay, nice. We have a shop. Alright, let's see what we get here. Uh, I can, you get you don't really get to choose what you uh, what you're buying here. Planks, longer bar. Oh, that, I'll I'll take it. That's that's quite nice. You can see you do have quite a lot of control over the direction of your ball. You just gotta you know be careful. Whoop. Okay, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna smash it. Whoop. Okay, that was- that was nice, actually. I want to hit that other cloud. Cloud actually kind of helps. Because it- it can hit it from underneath and then just ricochet it into, like, several... ...enemies. Uh. Oh god. Oh god. It's out of control. We have another sh shop. Okay. I'm, I'm doing- I think I'm doing a bit better this time. At least I don't feel like completely over my head. Okay, I, I wanted to visit the store before the, um... Oh no. Before the boss. Oh no. Oh, it, it shot it into the uh, store. Uh, I kind of want more plank. Okay, there we go. Longer bar. So I have an even longer bar now. Let's get that bat. I have a funny feeling that's going to give me more power on my paddle. Stronger smash. There we go. Nice. Oh, God. Oh, okay. Okay. You gotta be careful because sometimes it going high is not what you want. Oh no. No, no, no. It, again, it put it in the, into the store for me. You know what? Let's get uh, a longer paddle. This is uh, helping me out a lot. Solid. Look how long our paddle is. It's excellent. Nice. We we killed the boss. Okay, what is what is this? I got a, a piece of cheese. Piece of cheese, extra life max. I would like to get some life back. Ooh, that's an effect. All right, all right. Next level. I believe this is a roguelite 
So we can expect... Ooh. Whoa, what is happening? We have, like, funky gravity right now. Um, we can expect, um, obviously permadeath. I don't think there's gonna be unlocks. There are difficult or other challenge oh, levels, though. I think that might be a bit of homing. We are, we do have, we, we got a bit of our, our life back, I noticed. We have uh, two full moons now. Not sure how I did that, maybe just surviving is good enough. Really wanna take out some of these numbers, but they they have they have enough numbers that actually getting them getting over there is gonna be a challenge. Ooh, okay. Yes, yes. Okay. Alright, alright. Oh, we have our we have our first eye. It almost feels like we're, we're fighting, like, different parts of the face. I'm wondering if we're, like, trying to put the face back on the moon or something. You know, like the, the man on the moon? Okay. Uh, alright. We have two eyes now. Alright, alright. Yeah, I have, a, I have a child here who is demanding attention at, like, possibly the worst timing ever. This- our pedal is so large, I- I'm feeling pretty confident about our odds of survival here. Unless they throw something at me that I've never seen before, that will be- make things even harder. But hey, let's make that, uh, paddle size even bigger. And I kind of like that- the look of that slingshot. I wouldn't mind the bat as well, but well, on chance, chance to on hit, chance to shoot a pellet from the paddle. Okay, I guess that would um, potentially give us a bit more uh, attack potential. What does it mean on hit? Like we take a hit or we hit the the ball? I should have taken the bat. Ooh, that was nice. Ooh, there we go. Excellent. Okay, we're fighting the nose now. Who knows what could happen? Ugh. Oh no. Don't be, don't be snorting my ball. I want it, I want to hit that shop. Yes. Oh, oh, okay. You don't, you're not in danger in the shop. All right, let's uh, grab this missile launcher. Chance to launch a missile on hit. So we have a second weapon now. He's snorting all of the enemies. Yeah, this is a really fun game. I like this a lot. Why is our ball turning into ice? Different enemy- okay, the blue enemies turn my the ball into ice and then it gives it, like, non-Euclidean, uh, physics. Yo, don't start my ball. Don't snort my ball, actually. Oh. This is, uh, this is a really impressive game. I can't imagine, like, trying to program something like this in a month. Uh, what happened? I feel like I had two balls there at one point. Nice. Fork. Deal more damage. Excellent. 
What are these power-ups also? No! No, give me... No. Well, I mean, we're doing all right. I can probably recover that damage, but still, that sucks. Ooh, that was really good timing. And we did launch our missile there. That Those missiles are probably going to be pretty good. Oh! Yeah, I, I actually think uh, making our paddle, like, stupidly long has guaranteed our victory here. Okay, get that, get that, ooh, cluster there, and the, and the missile. So we have, like, elite-type enemies that give you, uh, sort of various effects. I don't know if they're meant to help you or hinder you. Ooh, that was close. Ah! It's, a, it's, it's like a, a, you're safe until you're not kind of game. I almost, I kind of wish that the ball was a different color, or maybe we could unlock, uh, you could lock, unlock a customization feature, because it's kind of blending in a little bit for me. I lose track of it occasionally. Luckily, we have the most ridiculous paddle right now, so... You know, we're, we're in no danger, really. Ah! We were in danger, and I, I, I did not heed that danger. Oh, God, I died again. Why did I have to say we were not in danger? Okay, okay. Just stay alive. Oh! I appreciate that there's a built-in recovery, so, you know, if you're at your last life, you it's not game over. It removes a little bit of the tension. I want that shot. Perfect. Look how much stuff I have right now. Uh, I don't want those software updates. I kind of want that spoon. I want the paper airplane as well. Spoon. Kills help regenerate life. That's nice. And let's get that mystery as well, since I can't afford the paper airplane. Crank. Smash charges faster. Smash charges faster. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, that's actually really nice. I love it. Now we can get really aggressive. We can, like, get really aggressive now. I love this. I don't- I don't even know where our ball is sometimes. I think we're alive. Yo, get in there! One, one eye is down, I think. Now it is. Now one, one eye is down. We're at full health. Get in here, eye. Oh, there's a shop as well. I wouldn't mind getting that shop. We have, we have a lot more money. Shop, come on. Shop. It's, I can't. There's so much stuff going on. I can't get to the shop. Shoot. All right, we we killed the eye. I was unable to get to the shop, unfortunately. But we're gonna deal more damage. That's nice. I wonder how many levels there are. Survive one hundred percent. 
shop. Oh, uh oh, I got uh, I got bamboozled. Meet Remy. Complete. Face the final boss. Remy is the I think the main developer in Punk Cake. The moon. Finally, it has arrived. Thank you so much for bringing it to me, kind stranger. Wait, the moon is the ball? Yes, I hijacked the trajectory of your moon paddle to get you here. A genius move, if you ask me. I hope you had safe travels. Haha. -ha. What's this? You need need it back? Ha, I think it not. It took you long enough to get here. Indeed, my dear errand runner. I'm afraid this is the end of your run. I don't think so. Yo. This is so good. This really um kind of reminds me of the uh the vibes from the like original Game Boy camera. This is gonna be a reference that no one gets, but like, if you ever played the original Game Boy camera, it had this kind of like weird creative vibes that I really appreciate. Oh no, ball gone, ball gone. Oh, where is it? Oh. Okay, we've dealt with the nose and mouth. We just need to deal with the eyes. Oh! There's there's a lot of quite a lot of forgiveness with the the ball. I love this music. I want to get the soundtrack, honestly. Oh my. Okay, we There's not nearly as much chaos right now, but we've only got the one eye to deal with. Wow, our ball just kind of like really sunk into that Death Star there. That was that was really good. Went right for the vent. Ooh, that was nice. You really want to get it near the edge of the paddle so you can control its direction a bit. What is this chaos that is happening right now? Jeez. Yes. We're, we're so close. Oh, that was weird. I, th I thought we were donezo. Oh God, we are donezo. There we go. Sneeze enjoyer. Complete the game. The moon was, was back, but not for long. Painfully predictable, says scientists. NASA to relaunch the moon paddle to bring the moon back. The quantity of rare materials required by the moon paddle isn't really helping, really isn't helping the climate situation. I kind of skipped the ending there, unfortunately. So we have a new collection. Okay, so these are all the power-ups, and uh, we can see common and uncommon power-ups. That's kind of a nice touch. There's some unlocks. Get five helpers, including satellites, paper planes, and ghosts to unlock. So we got some, we got quite a nice amount of replayability here. Uh, more enemies, faster ball, two max lives. Okay, we'll try hard, but uh, as is very typical with my experience in uh, Punk Cake games, I'm probably not going to uh, survive. Punk Cake games are already kind of hard, although I will say this one um, falls on the fairly lenient, but I also did get lucky with my longer plank. Um, but hard mode tends to mean exactly what it sounds like. I will say the uh, controller um, controls are, are pretty comfortable. I'm using uh, like left thumb on my left analog stick and uh, right um, shoulder button to hit the paddle or launch the paddle. And it, it works really well. It's actually very comfortable. And yeah, you do basically constantly want to be keeping a direction. Even if you're in the right spot, it just makes more sense. This is this was an excellent th game though. I, I I gotta say, worth the wait. And uh, I mean, like, just ridiculous creative vibes going on in this one. I I love that you're fighting chunks of a face that's just like really deranged and unhinged. I love it. Oh no.
Sometimes more enemies is actually helpful in a way because it keeps the ball out. You know, it keeps it up. And then you get more money as well. I don't know, maybe maybe hard mode isn't, uh, it's not going to be as bad as I think. No, never mind. That's me wrong again, isn't it? Oh! Okay, we get one last chance. Oh, really thought that was it. Oh! They, they were not kidding when they said longer uh, or quicker ball. I want that store. Give me that store. Yes. Oh, God. Crank. Smash it. Charges factor. Okay, I mean, that that's nice. Not really what I wanted. Okay, let's get over there. All right. Probably gonna die, but that's honestly fine with me. I didn't want to do necessarily a full game, but we'll, uh, you know, I'm gonna try my best. We'll see what happens. Maybe I'll recover. We're at the boss. Oh god! Game over. Well, can choose not, choose to not buy an item and save up the money. That's a good tip for someone who is poor, you know? Um, this is a really cool game. Might be my favorite. Might be my favorite Punk Cake game. Yes, even more so than Shotgun King. Um, I really, really love uh, the consistent quality that Punk Cake um, shoves out the door, and this one is no different. But um, maybe, maybe you'd like to see more of it. Maybe you'd like a little mini series of Moon Pong because it does deserve it. Um, you know, just to see all that is offered in this experience. I think this is one of the few Punk Cake games where I could possibly defeat it uh, on hard mode. It doesn't seem too bad, but uh, you let me know, and you know, let me know what you what you want. But uh, congratulations, Punk Cake, on, on another winner, and and. Um, yeah, and maybe you want to hit this that, that like button and consider subscribing for more content like this. I'll see you guys next time. Take it easy.